Director of the Guyana Civil Aviation Authority, Lieutenant Colonel Retired Egbert Field, in an interview with the newsroom, said the goal of the collaboration with the Guyana Tourism Authority is to open up the country to more Guyanese. One of the major problems is the high cost of air travel within Guyana. Uh, we have set up uh, a team and they are working uh, together uh, to ensure that uh, not only the flights uh, can be increased, but uh, also looking at the increase in domestic uh, tourism, uh, having Guyanese move around Guyana uh, in, in a faster and uh, have them move more regularly around Guyana. Apart from the proposed increase in the amount of flights to local interior tourist destinations, Director of the Guyana Tourism Authority, Brian Mullis, had indicated to the media in July that the organization is looking to make adjustments that can help Guyanese travel more affordably around Guyana. Last year you would have um, seen that we launched a program called Guyana Getaways, and essentially what we've been doing is we've been working with the sector to engage in strategic pricing. So you can price your products at the highest amount the market will bear in your tourism high season, but in your low season, you should be pricing at a more attractive level. So we saw a number of operators pricing on a tiered basis based on the size of the groups that they're attracting, others offering discounts across the board during their low seasons and offering those packages actively through our marketing and promotional efforts so that we can get more Guyanese traveling. Mollis then stated the GTA and the Aviation Authority have also been working to restore scheduled flights to some airstrips such as Anai, Surama and Fairview that are not currently being serviced. The government recently announced that travel to 60 interior destinations will be free from value-added tax. We're working closely with them because we, are, we also recognize it's not only a benefit for uh, tourism f from the tourists overseas, but also the local uh, residents. Some who never gone to Kite Shore or Anai, but uh, find uh, themselves in New York and Toronto and they can't answer the questions of what uh, let them looks like. Minister of Business Hemraj Rajkumar recently said the tourism sector will continue to be a high priority for the government of Guyana because of the transformative potential it holds. Nigel Collymore, Newsroom.